welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Ruby Patchouli today I'm going to be doing a curly hair routine right now I am freshly washed and I'm about to start styling my hair I washed my hair with the Olaplex shampoo and then I went in with Myel strengthening mint deep conditioner and now I'm here so for this hair routine I really want to have hold definition juicy curls I would like some volume as well and minimal frizz let's start with the routine all right i am going to go in with my leave-in conditioner because i never forget that step today the leave-in conditioner that i'll be using is the imbu leave-in conditioner i put it in my handy dandy mister bottle and i added some water this is filter water because i live in la there's hard water hard water is not the best water for your hair all right let me spray my hair down so this is a lightweight leave-in conditioner. So I'm not scared with over saturating my hair with it. My hair feels so nice and soft today. All right, next. I'm going to be going in with the Maya Rosemary Mint Daily Styling Cream. I will be pairing this with a jelly because I'm going for hold. Right, it's a section hair and a apply product to damp or dry hair. So because I will be using three products in this video, my leave-in, my cream, and a gel, I am only going to section my hair once. So I'm going to be careful when I apply the product. I put about like four pumps and i'm applying it very lightly like this and now i'm gonna take the rest i actually part it again and then put the rest on the second part that i sectioned off and then one pump for the front of my hair my cream on and now I'm gonna apply my gel which is gonna be my whole step what I'm gonna be using today for my whole step is the Camille Rose curl maker it's a defining jelly this is the only gel that I like to use like I'm matching with it today and it's because it's so lightweight apply generous amounts of fresh freshly washed and detangled hair distribute evenly through sections from root to tip let me just pass my brush through my hair this is a nude brush I'm using. I am gonna apply my gel in sections. Let me do one section here. Just gonna put a little bit. So I am applying the gel pretty lightly. I still have a lot of gel on my hands. start brush styling my hair so I will be taking some sections like right behind the ear this channel is a channel where I style my hair different types of ways I try to figure out different techniques that work and if it works for me I hope that it'll work for you you can give it a try sometimes when I am filming I <laughs> I don't have a plan I just need to do my hair so I film it and I know that it can help someone else as well because I'm not the only person with this type of hair so now I have my pick and this is how I'm going to spread my curls if that makes sense I'm going to pass the pick so that my curls can separate and now I'm gonna turn my hair upside down and brush the the crown area a bit more so now that, th that that's done I'm gonna put some more gel on my fingertips just on my fingertips and I'm going to graze my ends 
with my fingertips. So this is how my hair is looking. My hair is styled. What's left is to dry. I'm going to diffuse in the baño. I'm not going to show that because you guys have seen me diffuse my hair numerous times. So let me do that and I'll be right back. later so these are my results for today's curly hair routine i just finished diffusing i also scrunched out to cast there are a few mistakes that i made first mistake i made was using the wrong pick so this is the pick that i used you can see this is the pick i normally use it has you can see the difference it's wider the picks are pretty straight if you're gonna style your hair with a pick, I would suggest using this one, not this one, because this left me with like weird raggedy curls. I did have to go back in and finger coil you my bangs. I'm so frustrated when it comes to my bangs. I've been growing them out for a few months now and I thought that I could get away with not finger coiling them, but I couldn't because this pick for some reason gave me a lot of like straggity curls and frizz so i had to re-wet the front and finger coil i had a cast which is very nice so that means that i will be able to style this hair for a few days and i should be good with it as long as i'm going to sleep with my satin bonnet and satin silk scarf well, in silk scarf. <laughs> so these are my results. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you can, please hit the like button and subscribe, share. This helps my channel. I would really appreciate it. This is Ruby Patchouli signing out. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I will be back next week for another one.